SEMA's uh, expertise with marine and port engineering goes back to over 40 years. And if we just look back at, in humanity uh, for many years, many hundreds of years, we've been transporting bulk through, from continents to continents. It was the easiest way to transport huge amounts of materials at low cost. And many of our privileged clients still undergo this mode of transportation. We're very privileged to serve our clients along the St. Lawrence, and these would be the Port of Montreal, Port of Quebec, as well as First Nations, because there's quite a few uh, ports in the northern of Quebec, also Public Works Canada, and uh, the, the mining companies, because we also are able to uh, transport some of the minerals from the North Plan towards Asia. Our success at SEMA comes from the fact that we do offer integrated services to the clients with respect to the expertise of port and marine work. Well, project related, um, uh, CIMA was involved in several uh, steps of the uh, build up of our uh, model, uh, our project. In Port Daniel, uh, Gaspésie, we built with uh, CIMA in the whole project a marine terminal. Uh, that was the first uh, project uh, where uh, CIMA was involved. But myself, I was mostly involved in the U.S. with uh, CIMA in two projects. One in Providence, Rhode Island, whereby we delivered a uh, receiving uh, cement terminal and a, a truck loadout to ship our cement uh, to our customer. And also in the Bronx, New York, we uh, built a, uh, a new dock where we receive cement and we also shipping to our customer. It's a 100,000 uh, square foot uh, warehouse. Uh, it's over a $100 million project and it was the first year in 50 years that uh, the Bronx had this type of work in the East River. So a very uh, risky project, but very successful at the end and we're very pleased with the end result. The team spirit or the team uh, structure we, we put around the project was, I believe, unique. It was not two teams. Uh, it was one team, Sima Mechanis merging together and behaving, and the signature was a Sima Mechanis project. The trust behavior that we put together, uh, I believe, was a, a, a one of the success factor of our project. Everyone exercised a leadership at, the, at their own level. And leadership doesn't mean that you need to supervise people. You, you're basically behaving like a leader and interact with the contractor, with the, the people on site. The leadership is to be self-starter and to be responsible and to make the project progress in the right, in the right way. And we had to uh, make many presentations, permitting uh, local recruiting, acceptance. And SIMA and McKinnis team together uh, and often SEMA represented uh, McInnes alone with the McInnes signature and, and basically making the community accept and uh, support our project. Without community support, there would be no project. Marine and port engineering is very important for SEMA uh, on the strategic side because part of our growth plan is really based on promoting niche markets and expertise. Thanks to SEMA McInnes, a major client, they have allowed us to show our knowledge in marine and port work in Quebec and export in the US, in New York and Rhode Island. In a very competitive world, SEMA is one of the very few privately owned firms that can offer this expertise. Mm -hmm.